I've recently had to replace the screen on my Fujitsu Lifebook. One of the guides I've seen online suggests that you have to remove the back of the computer and take quite a lot of stuff off to actually get to it. What I've actually found is far, far simpler. So what you will need is a Phillips screwdriver with a small head and there are four screws in the corners of the screen that you need to undo. So once those are undone, you'll be able to split the bezel from the outside of the screen. And this is what the actual screen is like underneath here. And you can either use, um, I used a knife, a normal kitchen knife, or something like a guitar pick, and you go between the two edges of the screen and it will lift this section off the front of it. That then unclips from the hinges and it will give you access to, like I say, to the screen underneath. And there are two screws just where the hinges are that you will need to undo that will allow you to get the, the screen off. And then also you can see on the edges of the screen there are screw holes, top and bottom, that you'll need to undo, which secure the screen to the hinge mechanism. Once those are undone, you have a connector on the rear of the screen, and you just need to gently undo that, and then reconnect that to the new screen. And reverse is the assembly so just put all the screws back in at the side of the hinges connect up the hinges again at the bottom and refit the bezel and then refit the four screws it's a really straightforward process like I say there were some very confusing videos that I saw online but it is actually a lot lot simpler than most of them